Nurgul Salimova is here with me after a draw. Uh, and uh, how was your game today? Uh, it seems like Katrina Lagno was pressing a little bit. So um, did you feel some pressure or it was fine draw for you? I'm not sure exactly because, uh, I mean, I sacrificed the spawn. I knew this idea, of course, and uh, black should be okay. I was sure I was fine, but uh, when I castled, played f6, I considered also other possibilities like a5, bishop a6, and some other pawn movements and rook a6 ideas. So, like, it was um, quite messy for me in that position because I saw many ideas and I was sure I was not sure with, uh, which one to go. Um, what I did, uh, I don't know, it, it ended in draw, so maybe it was good. But uh, yeah, of course, uh, I, I was not, uh, I was never better, I think, I don't know. And I didn't see anything better than what I did. Uh, yeah, uh, with black is, is fine, I guess. So the first half of the tournament is over. How do you assess your performance so far? And do are you going to make any changes for the second part? Um, tournament did not, uh, first part did not go so well for me. Uh, I, I have three points, yeah, <laughs> of seven, I guess, yeah. I mean, yesterday against Goretzkina was uh, quite sad for me because uh, first I messed up again my line and then just lost like a kid, which uh, felt quite bad. But I'm happy that I stabilized my mentality after such a sad loss. And today I was fine. Well, for the second part, I will... Uh, I will not change much, like I will still try to prepare and do my best, like first half is over. For me it's like a second tournament is starting. So yeah, let's uh, let's hope it goes better. Your second here is Ivan Chiparinov, a uh, very well-known Bulgarian Grandmaster. During the first three days he was playing in a Blitz tournament actually. How did you let him go to play in the tournament? Why didn't you make him sit and prepare and prepare and prepare? Well, he prepares, but I forget. <laughs> so <laughs> maybe Blitz was fine, but uh, no, I'm joking. But uh, I mean, I think it's very fun to play Blitz. I, I also love to play Blitz, but unfortunately or fortunately, I have candidates to play, so I was uh, I couldn't go and play. But uh, he did well, I guess. He said uh, he was sharing first with yeah. Mamedarov, yeah. So so great. One of us at least did well. <laughs> Uh, so, on this note, actually, what is your favorite format for chess? Is it classical, bleeds, maybe rapid? It's classical, I like to think. And, but I'm fine, like, I don't, I don't uh, mind, I can play anything. Uh, maybe least favorite is still bleeds, of course, because it's, uh, like, too short, like, three minutes. But uh, I'm fine with, uh, with anything. And what about online play? Do you prefer over the board or online? I used to play a lot online before, but not not so much anymore. So, okay, well, over the board, of course, is different. Maybe because also during pandemic, there was only over, uh, online chess and like even tournaments. And at some point I was like, uh, just super tired of it. And okay, it's different, you know, to come to a playing hall, see all these people and prepare and play. It's, it's completely different, of course, over the board. So you're still a young player. Uh the whole career is in front of you. What do you think um, is the future of chess? Will it be online or over the board or what do you think the future holds? Well, over the board for sure, but uh, I, I don't think classical will be uh, that popular. I think uh, it will be shorter time controls because uh, I think also this is important so chess uh, can enter TV, television because I don't think someone enjoys watching uh, five hours of classical chess. And of course, it's more fun to watch rapid and so on. But uh, I mean, I will always be a fan of classical chess because of the deep uh, mm -hmm. depth of the game and ideas and everything. So yeah, I hope uh, it stays as long as uh, possible. Well, finally, do you have a s any special plan for tomorrow's free day? Mm, no, no, again, uh, previous uh, free day, I. I mean, I tried to rest, I went to some nice restaurant, I watched the sun, and uh, yeah, this time, I don't know, I mean, probably repeat the same. Thank you very much. See you day after tomorrow.